doesn't love a day of sun, water, and boating? It sounds like a summertime dream to be that person on that floaty. Yes, all that fun is great until the hunger kicks in. It's not always easy to reel everyone in and get back to land for a snack break. Now there's one high school senior changing that. WCI3's Amanda Brennan brings us to the water in tonight's Celebrating Central Illinois. When you place a delivery order, the driver normally drops it off in their car. But I bet you wouldn't expect a boat making the delivery. So Nessie's Boat Dash is a food delivery service on Lake Shelbyville. It all started with an idea in Elizabeth Reed's high school CEO business class last year. First thing we did was we made a business plan. Over the course of the semester, that plan evolved into this. Hello, did you place the delivery with Boat Dash? After getting approval from the Army Corps of Engineers, her small business hit the ground running near Nessie's at Lithia Springs Marina. She wants to make things as easy as possible for anyone hitting the water. If, you know, you're hungry out on the lake and you don't want to come all the way back in to get your lunch or a snack or dinner, then you can either call my number or you can go online and place an order and I will deliver your food out to your boat. For her, it's all about giving back to the place she has always considered a second home. I decided to start this business to just the poor and just draw more attention to the lake and just another service to help people have a good time out here. Her favorite part? Just seeing the faces and like how excited they are when they receive the order. Over the last few months, she says orders have been flowing in. There's been some cup, a couple busy days, but she's eager to grow and continue developing business skills into the future. My goal is to just make families happy and just bring more convenience and fun to the lake and just bring a service that a lot of people can enjoy. Reporting in Shelbyville, Amanda Brennan, WCIE 3, your local news leader. She says she plans to keep the business going this summer and next. Once she goes to college, she's thinking about passing it off to her sister. If you'd like to place an order, we've got all the information you need to know linked on our website, WCIA.com. That is a fun job.